gaps between the plastic, cold air coming in, warm air in the room. This is the coldest point here and this is the dew point, which is where you're getting all this black spot mold appearing. Stuart here from SD Roberts Plastering and Insulation in Warwickshire. I'm going to talk about window frames, the importance of insulating reveals. Now when we install internal wall insulation, one of the common issues that we see time and time again is poorly insulated window frames, window frames that haven't been sealed properly. So customers will say things like we've had the double glazing in, we've had the old wooden windows replaced, we've got double glazing but the room is still cold, we can still feel a draft. Now the reason for that is guys, if you have a look at this, I've just been removing some of the um, plastic trims that run around the window frame and you can see here guys we've got a huge gap between the window frame and the brickwork same down here now you can see there's no sealant or foam between the window frame and the brick what they've done instead is they've used this plastic trim which has absolutely no thermal resistance whatsoever and they've just slapped that over the top to hide any gaps. Now if these window frames aren't sealed properly with either foam or um, silicon sealant then cold air is going to fire through this gap and it's going to come through this plastic. Again there's no insulation value at all to um, this trim. Same problem all the way around the top here and I'll remove this, you can see here the frames haven't been sealed properly. So what we do when we install internal wall insulation we always remove all these trims just to check that the frames have been sealed properly. We'll use a, um, a polyurethane sealant and we'll infill all the gaps all the way around and we'll typically strip away the reveal back to brick and we'll either install depending on how much margin we've got so for example on this one we've got a, a fair bit of um, window frame there to play with so depending on how much margin we've got we'll either use a 37 mil PIR plasterboard or if it's very very tight for example here if it's very tight then we'll use um, a vapour control board which is this foil backed plasterboard here. Once the windows are all sealed properly and the reveals have been insulated properly you won't have any black spot mould which you can see down here. Black spot mould forming because these reveals have become a cold bridge as you can see. Gaps between the plastic, cold air coming in warm air in the room this is the coldest point here and this is the dew point which is where you're getting all this black spot mold appearing i hope that helps guys for more information on internal wall insulation visit the website in the description we'll see you on the next video